My Cool Inventions, where you vote to make or break an inventor's dream. With your host, ACOS the Solutionist. Now, here's ACOS. That's right, here's ACOS the Solutionist hosting My Cool Inventions with co host Andrew Jankira. That's right, and this is the show about invention, innovation. <clears throat> Inventors come here every day. They yep. pitch their products to you guys, and you guys vote. You guys vote thumbs up or thumbs down. You decide who has the next $100 million because that's what it's all about. You guys voting and getting these guys going. Well, I'm going to tell you something. Let me give you a little update. Okay, a little update. Uh, um, yesterday, we had our first inventor master class. Let me tell you what we do there. We take the inventor, and we actually try to teach them something, inventor master class. And it was a fantastic thing. We had a, a limited quantity of seats. We had 200 seats. Yep. Finished, no more. I didn't want too many because of all the questions that were coming at us. You know, when you have too many, it's like, I can't get to the question. So we limited the seats to 200, and we sold it out. That, everybody showed up. It was yesterday at 1 o'clock, Thursday at 1 o'clock, and we had a ton of people online. And the questions were amazing. The Inventor Masterclass was so successful. People loved it. They took away some of the best things about learning how to sell their product, learning how to conduct their business business and it was free which is a fantastic thing so we decided next wednesday uh, i got steven streaming there what time 11 o'clock one o'clock what time wednesday one the, two o'clock <laughs> that's, that's what i do next wednesday at two o'clock we're going to do another inventors master class inventor master class so if you're an entrepreneur you're a business person you're an inventor you got to attend this class so tony's going to put the link up there for inventor master class and you have to register because we want to limit the seats all right it's a closed group but we do teach you all the secrets all the ins and outs and i'm going to reveal the biggest secret you need to actually actually close the deal get funding get selling make a success for yourself i'm going to reveal a secret to help guide you guys on inventor master class tony's going to put the link right there in the facebook link for you so register 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 as quickly as you can because the seats are filling up for the next wednesday now that the buzz is out that everybody had a great time it was yep. it's really a good time there okay that's inventor master class now Another thing I want to talk about is every day we have a pitch, right? Every day an inventor comes here. We had a great pitch yesterday. Remember, yep. remember the uh, me mailbox sentinel? That oh guy? yeah, oh, that guy had his pitch down, right? Yep. He had he had like a, a film crew going on here, right? Yep. <laughs> and he was outside. This is a great thing. This is a mailbox that goes at the end of your driveway that actually will take your Amazon parcels, your UPS parcels, and it's smart. It actually works off your smartphone too. You can actually have a little video. You say, "Oh, who's that guy? Oh, that's that uh, that's that ugly Amazon guy." I'm gonna, I'm gonna open the door. Okay, he can, he can deliver a parcel for me. So you yeah. click wherever you're driving, you click open, next thing you know, the thing opens, you pop your Amazon parcels in there, and you're done and dusted. You got right. safety, you got security, and they were awesome. Great invention called the uh, Mailbox Sentinel. Now, what we're going to yeah. do, his name was Jeff Kutas. Remember Jeff on yeah. there? So we're going to let you listen to his pitch, and I'm going to tell you how you guys voted. Listen to Jeff Kutas' pitch on the Mailbox Sentinel. <laughs> Another trigger. <laughs> I have a great idea. Pitch it to me. Pitch it, pitch it to me. Hey, I got an idea. Well, let's hear it. Listen, shopping online is convenient, but the deliveries are disconnected. At NB Sentinel, we revolutionized the home delivery experience with our smart mailboxes. If you're an existing homeowner, or maybe you're building a new home, this could be right for you. We make smart products for safe living that will protect your parcels, identity, and those you love. Our smart mailboxes watch and lock everything and can be integrated with any security system. These robust aluminum and stainless steel cabinets are like having a personal property guard. We're not for everyone, but for those who we are, we can make your life better. Match your home's exterior with a free custom wrap or choose an amazing powder coat finish. Just for watching, get a $500 rebate plus free shipping. With incentives, base units start at $2,300. Go to mbsentinel.com for more details and follow us socially to know what's next. mbsentinel.com. MB Sentinel Enterprises, smart products for safe living. mbsentinel.com. Make or break an inventor. Be our shark and vote. Be bold and submit your product. What the heck? You can only make millions. So what did you think, Andrew? What was that uh, pitch like? It was very cool. Very good pitch. He had it all solid. He had everything down. He even had graphics. What, I, 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 what more do you want? Did you notice his pickup truck that had the graphics on the side was in the background as yeah. a billboard? I mean, everything is really... <laughs> I got to tell you something. That was a cool pitch. Now, yeah. I voted thumbs up. You voted thumbs up. Absolutely. Let me see how you guys did. You know how you did? 
93% of you voted thumbs up, baby. That's right. The mailbox sentinel. I think that's a home run hit. What a great yeah. adventure. What a great invention. Uh, we got to find a home for that thing. I'm going to get on the phone. You know, I think it would be great for shopping channels because, you know, like Evine, the customer, we, they sell jewelry. They sell watches. Yeah. They're selling thousand dollar watches and they're throwing in the front door. You know, the mail guy puts it right. Why not put it in a box like this? Yeah. Uh, secure it down there. And I think uh, how many Amazon customers out there? My goodness gracious, we have a parcel every single day. Yeah. And right now, this time of year, it rains almost every single day in the afternoon, and we got to race home before it gets wet. You know, yeah. we had the cat food out there the other day, and I thought, what's going to go on? There? There's going to be a big <laughs> soggy mess. That's what's going to happen. It's a good thing it wasn't cat litter. All right, so that's the that's the sentinel. <laughs> Today we have another inventor. Now his name is Emiliano Mara. Wow, so, sounds Italian to me, doesn't it? Sounds like it. it sounds sounds like it's good food at his <laughs> house. I'll tell you that right now. His invention is the Ambassador Five in One Grill. Wow. Now, there's a picture of it right there. I wonder what that does. So let's invite. Emiliano Mar onto the program. Yeah. Emiliano, welcome to the program. Emiliano. Hello. Did I get your name How right? How are you? Did I get the name right, Emiliano? <laughs> yes, Emiliano Marra. 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 Okay, we should talk spaghetti and meatballs. We should talk about pasta. <laughs> we should right. talk about the lemoncella, <laughs> something else. You know what I mean? And there, maybe yes. some ba barolo or something, right? <laughs> so, yeah. why, is some, why am I so hungry all of a sudden? <laughs> well, Emiliano, tell everybody, what is the Ambassador 5 in one grill? So, the Ambassador 5 grill is one... It's a symbol of unity, and this will unite different traditions and cooking methods from all around the world. Okay. Uh, okay. So in a matter of seconds, you'll be able to switch from one application to another one, starting from the North America tradition with the slow cooking, smoking, and grilling by using charcoal and wood. Oh, with a single rotation, you'll be able to experience Central and South America, all the way to Asia and India on the favorite method of cooking on a flat top. With other rotation, we combine tradition between grilling and flat top. And for last, speed the performance on your favorite gas grilling. So this grill is really everything a dream for everyone because it combines every tradition and unites every family to enjoy their favorite dishes at their home on the backyard. Are you kidding me? Oh. Did you see what he did? Oh, I want one. All right, I want one too. I mean, I, listen, if you're in the car on the radio, you didn't see the video, okay? Listen, listen to this. First of all, he's got a regular grill, then he cranks a crank, and it goes and from it the grill to a flat top, all right? Then right. he cranks another crank, and he's into a smoker. And this is a griller, a smoker. It runs on charcoal, runs on propane, it runs on. Oh my goodness gracious, this is a genius. Fantastic. I have never seen a grill like this. My goodness gracious, I hope. You know what? This guy's going to be so rich from this invention. I think he's going to have a Ferrari. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> 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 a Lamborghini. A Alfa Romeo. This guy, what a cool invention. My goodness gracious, I love this. And so, how did you come up with this thing? So, I've been in the food industry for more than 20 years, and I traveled the world. For, for business, and I enjoy different tradition and cooking methods from all around the world. And by doing that, of course I have a beautiful passion, you know, I have an amazing passion for cooking. I love to cook and I love to try different cuisine and different recipe. Uh, I was, um, in the past I was a chef and I worked in the, in the uh, food industry. Uh, and of course now I'm, it's been more than 10 years that I've been designing cooking equipment. This is not my first one. I did design some other equipment as uh, wood burning ovens that rotate as well. So this is not my first really invention. But for outdoor grilling, yes, this is my first one. And it's the most beautiful one because I do enjoy, I'm the first one to enjoy it every day or cook on it and cook on it and try different recipe and, you know, different cuisine. I am... I am watching the video again, and I am flabbergasted. He, listen, he's getting this thing up to 800 degrees Fahrenheit. Now we're talking about pizza. Yeah. Now we're talking about all the right. oh, wow. My goodness gracious. That is right. I'm there. You know what? I, I'm on a diet right now. I'm going to gain weight with this item. That's what I'm going to do. I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna, gaining weight looking right. at it. <laughs> yeah. I'm gaining weight just watching the video. You're 100% right. Oh, my goodness. So, so listen, um, how much is this item? I mean, do you guys sell it? Do you make it? Is it a prototype? Yeah. What's the deal here? Oh, States is a U.S. made product. Uh, all the components, the gas components, everything is U.S. made. Uh, the, 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 the product is for sale right now. We're doing a co-founding campaign 
and he's on sale on uh, Indiegogo campaign. The price starts at twelve ninety nine, only for twelve ninety nine. Of course, it's going to retail. Right now, it's a fifty percent discount for the first buyer that they back my campaign. Uh, afterwards, once he goes into the stores, it will be around twenty six to almost three thousand dollars. So. This is the time right now to buy. If you're interested to get a grill, and a grill that it will combine all the tr your tradition and cooking methods, and you can enjoy different recipes, this is the time to buy at a 50% discount. Oh my goodness gracious, so you haven't made them yet. You're on an Indiegogo campaign. You're looking for the investment. So people who are gonna be your backers are gonna get these first ones for like 1,300 bucks. Is that right? That is right. Wow. Tony, put that into GoGo campaign. I don't know if you have the link for it. Put that wow. link in the in the messenger there. Let's get this guy some advertising, some publicity. Let's get this guy because hey, t hey uh, Emiliano, where do you live? I live in Washington D.C. Okay, this planes that go to Washington D.C. Right? Yeah. Yeah, you can cook, right, Emiliano? I'm, I'm sure you have a pretty good cook, right? We're coming. I am. We're I coming am. to dinner. Okay, after church on Sunday, we'll be up there. Okay, we're gonna have some food, Please, right? Come on. <laughs> so I can listen after the break we're going to have Emiliano's pitch I want to hear this pitch in a 60 second pitch that's what we do every time and in the meantime I want you guys to get ready to vote I want you guys to go to mycoolinventions.com load that up on your screen get ready to vote because we want a thumbs up or a thumbs down on that and yeah. after the break Emiliano's going to come back cook us something I don't cook us up a pitch that's what he's going to do yeah. a 60 second red hot pitch in the meantime if you're an inventor and you want to come on to our program here it's really easy Go to MyCoolInventions.com. MyCoolInventions.com. Hit the submit button. That's all you have to do. And I want to hear from all the inventors watching. I see Rock Moore, awesomeness, he says. Joe Cups is pretty cool. <laughs> Amp Wealthy Brown said, really cool. We'll be back right after this. We're always throwing those used dead batteries away. That can get pricey. And battery rechargers are big and bulky. How do we get around this problem? Hi, I'll make us the solutions to tell you that most people have a USB port and we have USB rechargeable batteries. That's right, plug the USB AA batteries into any USB port and recharge them. It even lets you know with an LED indicator the status of the charge and there's a present voltage control circuit to prevent overcharging. The USB batteries can be charged up to 500 times. Now that's a lot of charges. Get these incredible USB rechargeable batteries and have charged batteries whenever you need them. Normally the USB battery sells for $39.99, but today only on the Daily Gadget, the USB batteries are only $15.99, and you buy one, get one free, get two batteries. Click on MyCoolGadgets.com or call 1-888-877-0490, one 877 490 order now. You have beautiful potted flowers, and they're all on the patio ground where you really can't see them. And you have that fence that is plain and empty. Hi, I make us the solutionist with the perfect solution, the Flower Pot Perfect Hook. These hooks were created to bring your potted plants up off the ground to eye level where they're in plain view. And they'll make that fence beautiful with flowers all around. The Flower Pot Perfect Hook is made to hold most potted plants that have a lip. Make your yard, garden, and patio beautiful with flowers. Normally the Flower Pot Perfect Hook sells for $29.99, but today only on the Daily Gadget get four hooks and two support arms, all for $14.75. That's only $14.75. Call 1-888-877-0490. That's 1-888-877-0490. Or click on MyCoolGadgets.com. Order now. Problem. Too many bottles, cans, or cups are dropped in the lake or they get warm on the beach before you're ready to refresh. Solution? The Floatinator. With the Floatinator, you no longer have to worry about dropping or having lake water spilled into your drink. Plus, both of your hands stay free. Hi, I'm Akos the Solutionist. Now you can take your drink into the lake, pool, or ocean and have your hands free at the same time. It's a cup holder with a tether line that you attach to your wrist so it floats with you. Made with a foam float ring for buoyancy, it also has a unique counterweight ballast that protects your drinks from wakes, waves, and cannonballs. Enjoy the water and your drink at the same time with the Floatinator. Buy it now. 
Normally the Floatinator sells for $39.99, but with the special promo code FLOAT, you can buy it for $29.75 for the next seven days. Call 1-888-877-0490 or go to mycoolgadgets.com. You're out at night and you need some light. You didn't take a big flashlight, so now what are you going to do? Now that is a problem, but I have the answer. Hi, I'm Ake Austin Solutionist with the Next Torch. It's the small thumb light you can put in your pocket. The Next Torch has a special white LED that is gentle to the eyes and has a reach of over 15 feet. Unlike other small light, this one even has a stand that lets you rotate the light 360 degrees. It also has a magnetic bottom plate, a bungee cord, a carabiner, which offers you countless ways to use your light. On the hood of your car, bungee to a tree limb, or just attach it to your jacket. It truly is the perfect pocket utility lantern. Normally the next torch sells for $39.99, but today only on the Daily Gadget, we have it for $19.75. Go to mycoolgadgets.com or call 1-888-877-0490 or go to mycoolgadgets.com. Order now. Welcome back. You're tuned into the My Cool Inventions Network. I'm Akos, the solutionist. Andrew, the incredible musician. We're product developers, product owners. We've been product sellers. I've, uh, we've been associated with over $1 billion in stuff sold. And uh, we always have an opinion on products and inventors. And that's why today, Emiliano Mara from Washington, D.C., with his 5-in-1 Ambassador Grill. And guys, if you haven't got the first part of this program, you got to see this video here. First of all, he starts out with a grill. He's cooking with a grill. Then he crank, turns a crank, and the thing turns into a flat top grill. He turns another crank. Now is a now is a smoker. Turns another crank. Now he's got it up to 800 degrees Fahrenheit. I mean, this is the best grill I've ever seen in the history of the world. <laughs> but now it's time for Emiliano's pitch. Emiliano's pitch. We're going to give him 60 seconds to pitch it. 60 seconds to win us over. Is it going to be a thumbs up or a thumbs down? It's going to be up to you guys. And here's what you guys all have to get ready to do. I want you to get ready to vote for Emiliano. And you go to, how do you vote? You go to mycoolinventions.com right now. Mycoolinventions.com, load it up there. Get ready to click the thumbs up or the thumbs down vote. That's all you have to do. So, Emiliano, are you ready for the best 60 seconds of your life? Yes. Let's do it. Do you have any ideas? I have a great idea. Pitch it to me. Pitch it, pitch it to me. Hey, I got an idea. Well, let's hear it. It's a simple unity, and this grill unites different traditions and cooking methods from all around the world. After 20 years in designing and developing equipment for the food industry, and have the privilege to travel around the world and enjoy different culture and tradition, I would like to present you with the number one grill. This grill is changing the idea of outdoor cooking. In a matter of seconds, you'll be able to switch from one application to another one. Starting from the North American tradition with the slow cooking, smoking, and grilling by using charcoal and wood. With a single rotation, you'll be able to experience Central and South America, all the way to Asia and India on the favorite methods of cooking on the flat top. With auto rotation, we combine tradition between grilling and flat top. And for life, speed and performance on your favorite guys' grilling. Make or break an inventor. Be our shark and vote. Be bold and submit your product. What the heck? You can only make millions. Wow. What a pitch. What a product. Oh, my gosh. Andrew, what did you think? Oh, I love it. You, gotta, you know, you can grill. You can put use the griddle. You can make eggs, bacon, you know, steak, steak and eggs. It's, it's awesome. Smoke, charcoal, Smoke, charcoal. propane. It's great. I mean, good product. Andrew, what did you do last night? What did you cook us? Oh, I made burgers last night. Oh, my yeah. gosh. Best burgers in the history of the world. Now, I got like a simple Weber. I don't have anything that I crank into suddenly there's a flat top for breakfast. Oh. I don't think I have oh, anything yes. cranked. Oh, yes. 
Not yet. Not I don't yet. have a yet on there. Hey, listen, everybody vote. What a great yeah. pitch. Everybody go vote. MyCoolInventions.com. Hit the vote button. Thumbs up. Thumbs down. What a great product. He's got my thumbs up. Vote all oh, day all long. long. Now, here's the deal, okay? Here's the deal. He's got a program on a campaign on Indiegogo. So it's called the Ambassador 5-in-1 Grill on Indiegogo. Now, I think, mm-hmm. what is it? What is it, Emiliano? 1300 bucks, 1299 or something right now? What is it? What's the price right now? $1.99. And when can I get it? If I buy one right now on an Indiegogo, uh, how long will it take for me to get it? Around two months. In two months from now, it will be delivered. Free delivery. Everything is included. So you will you will be delivered like in less, around two months. In two months from now. Have you worked out the math? How are you going to deliver it for free? Seriously, what's going on here? <laughs> so. Italian magic. <laughs> Italian, magic. <laughs> Italian magic. Oh my goodness gracious! Uh, listen. Um, so, what do you do for a living when you're uh, when you're not uh, being inventing like this? Well, I do have a I do have a food distrib- uh, equipment distribution. We on the commercial side, so we we develop an equipment for from wood burning oven. The name of the company is Marraforni too. All right, so I got Al. Okay, in my studio, I have a I have one of the best producers of infomercials in the whole wide world. His name's Al Footnick. He's actually producing the show right now. You guys, all the all the graphics and elements. He's punching the show. I got Tony back there. Whole production team. Al, nod your head if you're agreeing to this. Do you think this would be an awesome infomercial product? So, I mean, Leon, though, this is a, this is an infomercial product. We, you know, we're specializing in infomercials. This is a thirty-minute television show that we would illustrate and demonstrate all the cooking styles and everything, and then we would ask people to buy it right there on the TV. Can you imagine this on the Food Network? Oh yeah, that'd be great. On the Cooking Network. Oh my goodness gracious! I think this is actually a live shopping item too. Yeah. Six flex pay or twelve flex pay. Absolutely. So, so, uh, I mean, Leon, though, what, um. When is it going to be ready? Like, when are you going to be able to deliver a whole bunch of them? So we have, uh, we are starting manufacturing as we speak. So in the in the next month, a month and a half, we should have inventory available for clients to for the market. So even if the Indiegogo campaign, all the orders, but we are continuing to starting the production, and we will have availability in the next month or so. So this is an awesome product. I would love to do your infomercial for you. I think that would be a crazy cool I would product. Love that. Yeah. I would a crazy cool product. So uh, Tony, make sure I have his phone number. We should talk to him about this. Uh, and I got to tell you something. This is such a great product. I know that Evine, the shopping channel that we're on. I mean, they have an infomercial campaign. It costs about eighty thousand dollars to do the infomercial, but they would buy some. They buy a whole bunch of them. They would test it on their own network on the overnights. Yeah. And I think it. Uh, this is a home run. This is. You know why I like this. Andrew, because you can sell it all. I mean, North America is going to be hugely successful. Yeah. But you know, in all, think of all of our relatives in Europe, right? Yeah. Think of Peter out in his back terrace. Absolutely, he'll have one for sure. Everybody will have one. Yeah. Everybody will want one of these things. Anybody who's cooked salmon out in the back, anybody who wants a pizza. You know what I struggle with, Emiliano? With pizza. Yeah. I struggle with pizza because I don't have a pizza oven. I try to do it in my home oven. It's not hot enough. You know, it's just boring, not hot enough. So I take it out in the barbecue, and of course, it's not the right thing. Your thing here, if I yeah. can get it up to 800 degrees Fahrenheit, yeah. I'm cooking bread. I'm cooking pizza. I'm, I'm, yeah. what, a great, right. what a great product. I had, I had made pizza, pizza on the flat top. So on the griddle, yeah. you actually can put the, there is an internal burner in the center of the grill. And that burner can actually heat up the deck of the, the griddle. Nice. And that allows to cook the bottom of the pizza. And the infrared burner is being designed for the way. That's why I come from a wood burning, you know, experience as well. So I wanted these, these grills also to be able to, grill, to actually bake pizzas. And I did test and made several times pizzas on it. All right, so Tony, make sure I get his number, all right? Because we yeah. got to talk to this guy. I think this. Listen, I think you should be looking online for the uh, Lamborghinis, uh, the, the yeah. Alfa Romeos. Uh, this is this is a huge, huge product. I Absolutely. think I think it's one of the. I mean, listen, because you know why? Because if it's twenty five, twenty six hundred dollars retail, right? Yeah. It's like it's like think about the gyms that you've seen on TV, like the pro. What do you call those pro track gyms? Or yeah, help me out here, Tony. Bowflex and all. Bowflex, you know, all those Bowflex things. Those are expensive items, right? And 
and they they sell it on infomercial. Why? Because you need to show it. I mean, Emiliano has to show all the different things. Show that it's, I mean, he talks about it, but we want to see the food cooking and such delicious food with a food stylist. So when you look at it, you're just savoring. I mean, the first thing I saw, I'll buy one. Andrew will buy one. The, the, the moment I saw it, I wanted. The moment he showed me the five different functions, I wanted it. Yeah. If we did an infomercial, a 30-minute television campaign for you and ran it on the Food Network, I got to tell you something. This has got to sell. And of course, when all the retailers see it being sold there, yep. yeah, Home Depot's a shoe in I mean, all yeah. the people who sell this are going to jump on it. I that's think that's the, ca- that's the campaign. I'm going to get on the phone with you right after the show. And I want everybody to vote because this yeah. guy belongs on Inventor Showdown on the National Reality Show up in Minnesota at Evine Live there. So everybody vote. He needs a big vote. So Emiliano, get your friends, your family, share this video, get on Facebook, vote, vote, vote. You can vote on Facebook yes. on My Cool Inventions yes. page, or you can go to the website, mycoolinventions.com and hit the vote button. Emiliano, yeah. you're awesome. I'd love to share a little barolo with you one day and maybe a little prosciutto <laughs> and you know, a little antipasto, you know. I think I think you and I could eat. I think I bring Andrew here. I'll yeah. bring Andrew up there. We'll eat up a storm. We'll grill. We'll sit there, eat while you food feed us with a grill. How's that on there? <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, thank you for being on the program. Love you guys. All right. Okay. After the break, we're going to do a little secret selling stuff. So stick around. You take that last sip of coffee before your meeting and you guessed it. It's all over your shirt. Now what? Hi, I make us the solutionist and you can solve that problem with the S2O stain removing pens. The S2O pen is a concentrated stain remover that you can take anywhere. Put it in your purse, pocket, or your car. The effective stain remover can remove any stain from ink, grass, cosmetics, or food off of anything. Just take the pen and rub it on the stain and the stain is gone. Simple as that. So enjoy that cup of coffee knowing you have the S2O pen in your pocket. Normally a three pack of S2O pen sells for $19.95. But today only on The Daily Gadget, a three-pack of S2O pens are free. You heard me right, free. Click on MyCoolGadgets.com or call us 1-888-877-0490. Get your three-pack of S2O pens for free right now. Problem, the matches are wet, lighters damp. How are you gonna start a fire? Solution, survival steel. This simple, brilliant device ensures that you can start a fire every time, even in the rain or snow. It's safe, fast, it even could be a lifesaver. Hi, I make us the solutionist and let me tell you about survival steel. It's made from cerium, which is one of the Earth's element, and it can make a spark hot enough to set a fire to almost anything. If you've ever needed to start a fire, survival steel will do the job under any conditions. Look at this. In the rain, dripping wet, or in the middle of a snowbank, survival steel starts a fire each and every time. This 3,000 degree spark isn't red hot, it's white hot. Survival steel is a necessary tool for all outdoorsmen. Normally, survival steel sells for $19.99, but today only on the Daily Gadget. Buy one, get one free. Both for $19.99. Call 1 888 877 0490 or go to mycoolgadgets.com. Those hanging baskets you bought are expensive, and you see more of the basket than the flowers. That's not what you wanted. You want flowers and more flowers, not baskets. Hi, I make us the solutionist with the perfect solution the better basket. The Betta Basket is a unique way you plant your flowers. There are 12 holes around the lower and middle of the basket with removable panels that make it easy to plant your flowers. When done, your Betta Basket will give you a perfect flower arrangement from the start. As they grow, they will sculpt themselves into something truly amazing. It's also perfect for growing strawberries, tomatoes, and herbs. All you see are flowers, fruits, and herbs. Betta Basket normally sells for $29.99, but today only on The Daily Gadget, you can get it for $19.75. Call 1 888 877 0490. That's 1 888 877 0490, or go to mycoolgadgets.com. Okay, you're exercising. You need cardio equipment, strength training equipment, and all kinds of other pieces. That's a lot of stuff, and it can be expensive. If you don't have the space or money, that can be a problem. 
Hi, I'm Akos the Solutionist with The Solution, The Workout 180. This one piece of equipment incorporates strength cardio stability exercises to give you a total workout. It's not only an exercise step and balance board or a push-up bar, it also comes with resistance bands. The seven different levels allow you to reach your results by consistently increasing the band resistance. The Workout 180 is affordable and an effective way to reach your personal goal. Normally the Workout 180 sells for $199, but today only on the Daily Gadget, the Workout 180 is $59.75. That's $140 savings for the best workout system you can buy. Call 1-888-877-0490. That's 1-888-877-0490. Or go to MyCoolGadgets.com. Order now. Your car is as hot as heck. And that stupid folding thing keeps falling down, not protecting the inside of your car at all. Hi, I'm Akos the Solutionist, and that can be a problem. The solution? The Keep Cool Sunshade. With this sunshade, you simply attach it to the windshield with suction cups on the passenger side, pull it across the windshield and hook it on the other cup on the driver's side. Done. Easy, quick, and no mess from that flicking cardboard folding thing. The answer to keeping your car cool the easy way is their self-retracting Keep Cool Sunshade. Normally one Keep Cool Sunshade sells for $19.95, but today on the Daily Gadget, half price, $9.75. Not only that, the next 50 customers will buy one, get one free, still only $9.75. To boot, free shipping. Call 1-888-877-0490. That's 1-888-877-0490. Or go to MyCoolGadgets.com. Order now. Welcome back. You're tuned into the My Cool Inventions Network. I'm Akos, the solutionist, Andrew Jankura, right here, the co host. It's all about inventors, it's all about invention, it's all about entrepreneurism. I don't care if you're listening on one of the 53 radio stations or if you're on Roku TV, Amazon Fire, Android TV, any of those platforms. Wow. You're all entrepreneurs wanting to sell stuff. Am I right or wrong? So, this is the part that we actually have a thing called selling secrets. Yeah. What is the selling secret? What is the secrets to making your successful product? Product. Let me tell you some. Now you were doing some uh, research on Amazon the other day. Okay, That's yesterday great. I guess yesterday. Okay? Yep. Because you know we always focused on Amazon trying to build that success. And the question we always get from inventors: Do you manufacture in America, or do you manufacture in China in the Far East? Now you've heard a lot of things about the news right now because it seems to be a trade war uh, brewing. Yep. And the trade war at this time is kind of the high level stuff. You know, stuff like landing gears of airplanes or whatever they're doing. It hasn't really affected. The kind of the Walmart gadgets selling inventors type right. inventions type of a thing, but I think that's not that far away. I hope these guys back off and calm down because yeah. you know this could be a really real mess, right? So, so I want to want to cover here because we always have this debate: should I manufacture in China? Or should I manufacture in America? All right. So let me give you some insight on that. Now you have you've had music stores and you bought a lot of stuff from China. You yeah. bought a lot of stuff. So what what is your impression? Because I know in the in the musical instrument world, you know, like a lot of our pianos ended up getting made in in the Asia, right? Yeah. So what is the difference in lots. quality between an American piano and something made in Asia? Well, there's there's a there's a few few big drastic changes. Um, wood quality is one. Um, the time, the different glues that they use in pianos, the the technologies that's behind them. But the truth is, the technology is an old technology. Now, some companies in in Asia, they they're smart. They go and buy the tooling from an American company and just buy the whole an old company out with tooling and send it all over in Asia. And then now they have the tooling that's in in in, in the in North America. So, class, a classic example is that uh, uh, we we owned a piano company called the Heinzman Piano Company. We manufactured pianos in Canada. And then what happened is a, an Asian company, a Chinese company, Chinese came company. along, yeah. right? Yeah. Bought the whole factory, lock, stock, and barrel, everything, Absolutely. all the manufacturing equipment, and they took it over. Over to China, so you had experience of the American Canadian made or American made Canadian made Heinzmans, and you had experience with the Chinese made Heinzmans. What are the differences? There was no difference. 
There was no difference. So, so you're telling me that the workmanship, that's the thing we're trying to talk about, workmanship. Now, right. a long time ago, there was, there, was, there was sort of a stigma about workmanship. They thought, ah, the Chinese workmanship is not very good. It's not true anymore. Their workmanship's kind of excellent now, right? So that's, that, that, that's kind of, kind of a, um, a, 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 it's not a difference anymore. In, yeah. in fact, all your iPhones and cell phones and stuff, these are all Chinese things. The workmanship is actually quite excellent because they figured it out. I mean, I mean these factories, and I've been to these factories, these factories are crazy clean, crazy good, crazy efficient. I mean, there's millions and millions of dollars set up in manufacturing there. So, you know, there's a phone. So I think, wow, well, that was a pretty good thing. I, I say iPhone and Al pulls up a video. Boom, just like that. <laughs> That's what I talk about production value right there. No wonder this guy's one of the best infomercial producers in the whole wide world. Take a look at that. So, so basically, manufacturing quality is probably on par. Okay, so then what happens is the Chinese work for lower wages. Yeah. So now it comes down to the labor cost is actually way lower than the American labor cost. Right. And I think that's where we realize some cost savings, right? That's where we realize some cost savings. Now, I got a couple comments. Steve Warple, uh, Glide Guys guys, the Glide Guys glides there. He's made in the United States, made in the United States. Now, his product is interesting, Andrew. You actually, you'd love this product. Uh, oh, Joe Cup has uh, chimed in too. Coaster Pro on the go, also made in America. So those two <laughs> items, in fact, I know those two items really intimately, the Glide Guys things. You know what his guy did? I'll tell you about the Glide Guys. You know the furniture? Furniture movers, I mean, moving pianos and stuff, right. the furniture movers, right? right? So he has furniture movers, but you know how furniture movers, those those silicone slidey plastic things, right? Right. On, their, how, on an angle, if you had a chair on an angle, kind of dug into it, yeah. these guys solved that problem. They've got a furniture mover that actually pivots, oh, wow. so it's okay. even right. better. He's, he's taken cool. an invention and improved it. But basically, it's silicone and, and, and plastic. It's kind of easy to make in China. And right. uh, Joe, the Coaster Pro on the go, that's, that's, I believe, a chamois material. Now, I agree with Joe in the sense that chamois materials, the Chinese chamois materials aren't as good as the German ones. I know right. I know the German chamois materials are way better than, the, I mean, we buy chamois, so we, we're in that yeah. business. So we're still buying from Germany. We're not buying from China yet. So workmanship is there. Value of labor is lower. So there's the Chinese advantage, lower labor value. The second China, but however, it's offset by shipping. Usually American manufacturers are closer, so you don't have to ship it. If you don't think shipping is something, all you have to see is my American Express, because everything we ship, we always throw it on the American Express. I mean, we're shipping millions of dollars. I mean, it's good for points for me, but but I got to tell you something. I mean, I see the cost. I mean, a container, four, five, six thousand dollars to move from China. So if you've got a container of pianos, well, well, maybe you only got 30 pianos on there. Yeah. Now you got 200 bucks a piano to move it. <clears throat> now, okay, is that offset the labor cost? So you got to do this analysis. If you're an inventor, you got to make a spreadsheet and get the cost benefit ratio to figure out what is the deal. All right. Now, the second thing I want to talk about the inventions that don't need labor. Now you're thinking to yourself, what's that man talking about? What's that man talking about? <laughs> Money adventures. There are things that don't need labor. And Steve, your Glide Guys thing, not much labor needed, all right? Because if that's a plastic thing, I mean, I've been to many factories in Canada and America. I've been to factories in Germany and I've been to factories in China. By the way, the plastic machine they use all made by the same guy. <laughs> and they literally, I mean, there's a machine, a big mechanical machine. Actually, I think they're German. I think a lot of these guys yeah, are making yeah. it from Germany. Right. So the machine, I mean, what they do is they have pellets of plastic, and they're pouring it into one end in a hopper. Yep. And of course, the mold and stuff is inside, and out spits the plastic parts. Yep. I, I went to Honer in Germany, and they yes. were doing piano keys, or, or keyboard keys, because they were yep. making their keyboards and the accordions, the accordion keys out there. Cool. And literally, some guys pouring a bunch of plastic beads into one end of this thing. In fact, one of their machines didn't even have a guy. A truck pulled up, went down a chute, <laughs> wall, just automatically fed this machine. On the other end, they were spitting out these plastic parts, right? Now, you can do that in China, too, and you can do that in America, too, and there's no labor involved, right? Really no labor, a very minimal labor involved. Well, in that situation, maybe America's better, Okay, maybe that's why the Glide guys keep it in America, because when it comes to commodities like plastic, or <clears throat> I'm a chemist, it's ABS styrene, you know, remember, remember when people would say to us, <clears throat> What is that made out of? You know, we didn't want to say plastic because we thought it was cheap. Yeah. So we'd say, oh, it's ABS it's styrene. Sad. Oh, ABS styrene. That sounds expensive. That's plastic. <laughs> a little selling tip for you, a little selling secret. Call your plastic ABS styrene. Everybody thinks it's some high quality something, flute and stuff. <clears throat> However, now let's go back to the point. The point is, if it's a machine that's just got plastic beads and things are being spit out on the other side, America's probably better. 
I'll tell you why. It's no labor. So you just took away the Chinese advantage, right? Mm-hmm. And you took away the cost that comes to cost that comes to get down here. And on top of all that, on top of all that, uh, uh, you know, you know, the, the location's closer, so you probably shave your shipping. And Steve uh, Warple, the guy, guy goes, they have a machine that runs twenty four hours. Yeah. yeah, it does. As long as you got that hopper full of plastic, it's spitting up parts all all day long, right? Amazing. So I think that's the summary. The summary really is: is what is my invention made out of? What is my product made out of? Is it plastic? Uh, is it a machine automated thing? Well, maybe America should invest in those machines. By the way, uh, the plastic, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm one that I know intimately is this whole piano keys thing. So I saw the guys in China make piano keys. I saw the guys in Germany make piano keys. I saw us make piano keys. We were all using the same machine. Yep. And by the way, plastic is a commodity. It's the same price everywhere. There's no cheaper plastic in China or cheaper plastic in Germany or cheaper plastic in America. These plastic things, these recycled, you can do it by it recycled, you can buy the ABS styrene uh, fresh and you not recycled. Bottom line, some machine churns out these pellets. The bottom line, the pellets go into a machine and melts it down, puts it in a mold and spits out the other end. It doesn't matter because the plastic is the same price. And by the way, when we negotiate, don't think, if you hire us to help you in the manufacturing, don't think we're not on the phone yelling and screaming at the Chinese guys going, seriously, dude, it's the same plastic, all right? Same machine you're using. Okay, so you got some cheaper labor, but there's nobody touching the thing. So you better come out, you know, do you understand what I'm saying? So it comes down to manpower. It really comes down to skill set of manpower, right? And the Chinese for years have had this advantage, but it's changing. It is changing. The second thing China does, which, which you know, uh, which uh, I guess our current administration is pushing, uh, they subsidize what they're doing over there. They're dumping. All right, let me explain dumping to you. Mm-hmm. So we had a thing. We remember the piano dumping thing. I mean, what happens is, let's say I'm gonna I'm gonna call a piano uh, Chinese piano factory, and they yeah. let's say they make a black ebony beautiful grand piano. All right, what they would do in order to grab the U.S. market and steal it from the American manufacturers, they would sell it over here under their cost. Yeah, I remember this. That it was called dumping, right? Yeah. And of course, they would put these guys, all the American guys, out of business. I mean, Baldwin and Wurlitzer and Kimball and all these guys, and we can probably name ten more. They're struggling because these big companies in China, where the government was. Don't forget, it's a, it's not a, it's communism over there. It's not an entrepreneurism. It's some form of it. But bad bottom line is they still control and they were dumping it into our market. And they're doing it with cars too. That's called dumping. So therefore, the prices were cheaper artificially. And they're also probably artificially manipulating their currency. So those are the factors that I think the current administration's fighting right now. And here's the other thing. Will they steal your patent? Mm. The bottom line is usually no. All right. Now, if it's some trade secret, now what's happening right now is the trade secret. You make us NDA. What they there are, there are some. There's not always no, but the companies. I mean, when it comes down to to Glide guys and Joe Cups, Coaster Pros, nobody. I'm not saying the, the guys don't take this into respect, but nobody really cares. It's not changing lives. We're not winning wars with that, right? However, there is a thing about cell phones and Apple. A, a buddy of mine posted something out there where they showed an Apple Mac was knocked off so well that he thought it was a Mac. <laughs> Until he sat down to it and realized, wait a minute, this is not a Mac at all. So they are copying technology. So you have to worry about your patent protection, and don't be so scared of it. I think, I think, I mean, everybody assumes they steal everything. They don't. They don't. They're just stealing the stuff that matters to the probably winning wars and stuff, uh, mm-hmm. or something that important. So that's number one. Number two, it comes down to labor, right? Labor costs, and and number three, it comes down to shipping. So you got to take all those into consideration, whether you're doing America or China. That's just my two cents worth of all the experience we've had and billions of dollars of selling. Yep. Uh, so that's the selling secret today. And you learned a little thing about ABS styrene too. Don't call it plastic. Uh, hey, Steve, don't call your thing plastic. What's that made out of? Oh, that's some sort of ABS styrene to be <laughs> on there. And so that's the selling secrets on my cool invention. Do you have the next $100 million idea? Who knows? You got to keep moving. Stains are out. Stop the screaming with Stains Are Out. Oh my gosh, this is the greatest stuff ever. Thank you so much, Banana Man. Who was that Banana Man? Saving the world one stain at a time. Learn the secrets of bananas in my Stains Are Out at StainsAreOut.com. Problem, you're jogging and dehydrated from lack of water. That small water bottle attached to your waist is empty and hot and uncomfortable. 
solution, the Hydro Water Bottles. These ergonomically designed bottles encourage proper form and posture while running and walking. They provide upper body exercise and hydration. Hi, I'm Akos the Solutionist and let me tell you these Hydro Water Bottles are fantastic. You get two 16 ounce insulated bottles with easy to hold handles making them easy to carry. The two pounds of water weight will exercise both arms while jogging. You can even add more weight. Run better, exercise better, feel better with the Hydro Water Bottles. Buy it now. Normally the Hydro Water Bottles sell for $49.99, but with the special promo code H2O, you can buy them for $39.75 for the next seven days. Call 1-888-877-0490 or go to mycoolgadgets.com. Charging devices in the great outdoors in extreme conditions is always a dilemma. How do you charge your phone, tablet, or maybe that light? It can be a real problem. Not anymore. Hi, I'm Akos the Solutionist with the Extreme Tactical Power Bank. This power bank is portable, rugged power source, uniquely constructed with an integrated 18,000 milliamp battery. It's waterproof, shockproof, and dustproof, perfect for your next invasion. It has two USB outboard ports to charge two devices simultaneously. It even has a short circuit protection. The four LED indicators show battery life and status. The Extreme Tactical Power Bank also has a 30 meter torchlight, perfect for spotting your enemies. This power bank lets everyone enjoy the outdoors without worry. Normally the Extreme Power Bank sells for $99, but today only on the Daily Gadget, 59 bucks. Call 1-888-877-0490, go to mycoolgadgets.com. Problem, there's one or two times in the day you want to feel clean, but that isn't always the case. Solution, Bob's Butt Wipes. Their all-natural paraben-free formula ensures that you will be fresh and clean. Without exposure to harsh chemicals, it features a unique hanging dispenser that installs in seconds on your toilet paper holder. Hi, I'm Akos the Solutionist, and let me tell you, you can trust Bob's Butt Wipes that keep you clean. These wipes are biodegradable and dispense in under three minutes so your sewer system will remain clog free. You can easily put them into a specially designed dispenser or take them with you on trips. They come in a variety of designer containers for the children or the outdoorsman. Check out Bob's Butt Wipes for yourself. Wipes that work as hard as you do. Normally, the Bob's Butt Wipes sell for $19.75, but today only on the Daily Gadget. Buy one, get one free. Call 1-888-877-0490 or go to mycoolgadgets.com. Problem, it's raining and cold and you need to start a fire, but everything's wet. Solution, survival wood. This one piece of wood can save your life. Just chip some pieces from the stick and ignite it. It'll even burn when soaking wet. Then it burns hot, just add some more survival wood. Hi, I'm Akos the Solutionist, and that's exactly how you save your life, by starting a fire to keep you warm or signaling for help. Survival wood is made from the Guatemalan pine, rich in resin. It's a light wood that can be cut easily with the grain. Just a few chips will start a fire for you in any condition, in the rain or in the snow. But if you're in bad weather, a match or lighter may not work. Check out survival steel that can ignite the survival wood under all conditions. In the great outdoors, always have survival wood with you. Normally, three pounds of survival wood sells for $19.99, but today only on the Daily Gadget, $9.75. Just call 1-888-877-0490 or go to mycoolgadgets.com. Are you kidding me? Stop. Stains are out. Stop the yelling with Stains Are Out. From zero to hero, thank you. Who was that banana man? Saving the world one stain at a time. Banana Man knows the secret and my stains are out. You can too at stainsareout.com.
here's the problem. You have a meeting you're going to, you have a date you're going to, and you got hair in your nose. Oh, no, well, that's a problem. Here's the solution, the Super Nose Hair Trimmer. Now, the Super Nose Hair Trimmer runs on batteries. It's waterproof and so easy to use, and it's easy to clean. Just run it under a tap. It cleans out right away. You want the Super Nose Hair Trimmer? It's good in the car. It's good in the bathroom. Oh, my goodness gracious, it's easy to use. Look, there's Al's nose, and he's trimming his hair right there live on national television. You're going to have a greatly trimmed nose because nothing's worse than having hair coming out of your nose. If you want the Super Nose Hair Trimmer, normally it sells for $29.99. But on today's What a Gadget, we have it on for $12.75. That's right, $12.75. And go to MyCoolGadgets.com. Get your Super Nose Hair Trimmer because there's nothing worse than having hair in your nose. How many times has your wife looked at you? Oh, my goodness, trim that hair. Get it for $12.75 at MyCoolGadgets.com. Don't pay $29. $12.75. MyCoolGadgets.com. <laughs> How was that pitch, Andrew? That was pretty cool, cool huh? That was all right. Well, you know, you got to have a... I didn't do a double drop there. So, you know what I forgot to do there? It's free shipping and handling. I should have said that. There's your double drop. So, even I make mistakes sometimes. What is a double drop? I taught it yesterday in Venner's Masterclass. Uh, you do it to get the price, and then you drop it once, and you give them something else. So, it's two times you give them things. So, it's a double drop, we call it. Wow. And that's twelve seventy five free shipping and handling. Now, hey, pick that up there. Take a look at it. All right, it's cool. kind of cool, right? How, what do you think? Kind of cool. It doesn't have any cutting blades and stuff. It's got a really cool technology because a lot of these things, one of the ones I had, the IL had it in the video, it's kind of like a little comb and it goes back and forth like that. And okay. that rips the hair out of your face. And I hate that. I would never use that. So this is actually a very cool technology. What it does, I'm going to see it on the end here. I can see. See on the end? There's no cutting. Oh, there, there he is. There's Al using it right now. Um, that's right. That's why he's got no hair in his nose because he's using the super nose hair trimmer just like so. And I know you guys are all laughing at me. You're going, oh my goodness gracious. Why is that guy talking about nose hair? But you know something? You know, as you get older, once I turned 50, I think uh, hair started growing where it didn't belong. And then what <laughs> happened is where it was supposed to belong, it left me. It just doesn't make it to the top anymore. <laughs> it just doesn't make it. It just kind of goes halfway and then stops about here. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that true? When you get older, you know, the hair where you're supposed to grow is not growing. And, of course, uh, where you don't want it to grow, all of a sudden, suddenly, I, you know, hairs at the end of your nose start falling, coming off there. So you want to have some kind of a grooming device which I think is very, very in good to have. And this is the Super Nose Hair Trimmer. Let me show you the end here. That's what I wanted to show. You see the end here? This technology is a little different. Now, this technology is not your normal technology. Normally, they run like a comb that goes back and forth. And I think that has a lot of ripping action if it's not sharp. This has got a rotary blade in it. So the rotary blade prevents the hair from getting caught up in there. So when you turn it on, the on and off switch is right here. It's got a beautiful black and uh, uh, silver uh, technology. The batteries go on the bottom. And what I love about this thing, too, it's totally waterproof. So when you want to clean it out, run the water, run this part of the, the super nose hair trimmer under the water, and you can clean it out right away. So this is a very cool thing. It's got a lid on it. So, uh, you know, I, ca I carry this in my shaving kit. You know, I work on TV a lot, and uh, there's nothing worse than being on TV. Uh, actually, you know what the embarrassing part is? I have makeup artists, and the, and the last thing I want is them to actually have to trim my nose hairs. It's kind of uh, embarrassing. So instead yeah. of paying uh, over, you know, 20, 25, 30 bucks for it, 12 75 12 75 wow. free shipping and handling. Go to MyCoolGadgets.com. This is a cool gadget. It's MyCoolGadgets.com. There you can trim up a little personal hygiene there. Never hurt anybody. Because you know something? When you go to a meeting or you go to, uh, maybe you're going to work or something, these are the kind of little things that people notice that you you know, you know shouldn't really be exposed yourself to. And uh, it's called the Super Hot Nose Hair Trimmer. Cool. Now, in the music world, I know you guys are a little rougher out there, you know. A little, yeah, uh, you, know. you know. You're not trimming everything, you know what I mean? Uh, <laughs> on there, you know. <laughs> Some of the musicians that I've seen out there uh, uh, are, are, you know, a little less, little less. Uh, but the good ones, the really good ones, who want to make an impression out there. You know, the guys making big bucks, right? You want to do a little. There's Steve Warple. He's laughing at me with crying emojis. I, I want to hear your comments, guys. <laughs> hear your comments live on the stream of the Super Hit Nose Hair Trimmer there. Uh, that's pretty cool. Uh, everybody needs one. This is one of those things that, you know, we laugh about but we all need one and uh, you know you know what I, I, I gotta tell you something it's, it's, it's awful I, I'll share this story for private I usually rip them out of my face you know oh. what I mean that, that kind of, that's kind of a little violent to rip it out of my face and my <laughs> wife once caught me she goes what are you doing I go well I don't want these their hairs because you know there's devices that you don't have to rip your hair out of your face yeah it's right there um, it's right here in my hand <laughs> it's right it's easy to clean it's easy to use and a little bit funny but it's really cool um, you know something uh, it is awesome uh, is Tony writing this oh my goodness gracious Tony is actually talking about food prep 
people. Yes, I do not want hair in their nose on the fruit pep peeper. That's the video fruit of Al. Pepper. There's Al there. Uh, you know, that's <laughs> Al trimming his nose there on national television. You know, Al, what do you think? Fifty years of being in the business. Now you're you're you're, 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 you're introduced to actually being a model for. Like, we couldn't find a hairier guy. You know what I mean? We couldn't we couldn't actually find a hairier man than Al because as you get older, hair grows quicker and worse and faces you didn't want it. And uh, Al's the oldest guy we have here, so we we, we used him well, as a model. <laughs> he's he's saluting me for some reason. I don't oh, know. No. We have a window through to Al. We can see him through a window, and the control room is over there, <laughs> and uh, they're, they're they're gesturing at us. I don't know what they're gesturing. Do you make out what they're gesturing? I think uh, no, no, it's some kind of a salute. Uh, there. So some so kind. this is actually an important thing for everybody to have out there. Uh, it's called the Super Nose Hair Trimmer. It's normally a twenty five thirty bucks. We have it for twelve dollars seventy five cents. Free wow. shipping. Let me tell you about that free shipping. Ooh. That shipping costs us five, six, seven dollars, right? Depending on where you are, we throw it in for free. So when you consider that, that's a great deal, right? It's a really yeah. super deal. Go to mycoolgadgets.com. It's mycoolgadgets.com. I'm getting some comments. <laughs> Joe Cup on on the Don't feed. Rip it Don't oh rip God. them up by head. It hurts. <laughs> we have a big screen in front of us, so when you're commenting on Facebook, we see them all. Uh, we have a big screen. We have a, if, you, if you actually guys come to the studio, it's a pretty cool studio. We've got this control room over there. We've got a big couple of big screens in front of us. All the cameras in front of us, uh, and we see your comments immediately in real time. So uh, yeah. Steve Warpel sent me emojis with laughing out loud, crying. Joe Cups apparently giving me advice not to rip my hair out of my face. That's because uh, it hurts. I think he's right. It hurts a lot. So let's recap. <laughs> it's called What a Gadget. You know what we do every day? Uh, we do a gadget every single day. This is this one, the Super Nose Hair Trimmer. It's easy to use. There's the on and off switch, just like that. It doesn't have a. This has a rotational blade, not one that goes back and forth. And I think why that's important. The one that goes back and forth for me actually. Uh, um, um, you know, rips up the hair. This is great for the ears too. Uh, Steve Warple's asking, does it work on ears? Yes, it works yeah. really great on ears. Uh, also, anywhere you have unwanted hair, it works really great. And the rotary, let me tell you something, the rotary action is way better than the back and forth action. Right? Yeah. You rinse it off under the tap. That's really easy to do. What a great gadget. I know it's what a gadget. We call it the daily wag. And I'll tell you why we like it the wag, because we like you to wag more and bark, bark less. less. That's right. But a good idea. Going into the weekend, wag more and bark less. The weekend, you shouldn't be barking at all. You should just be wagging your tail the whole time. That's the what a gadget. Normally $24.99, 12 bucks, 75 cents. Free shipping and handling. Go to yeah. mycoolgadgets.com. Pick it up right now. $12.75. Pretty easy. Free shipping. There you go. Can't go wrong. Can't go wrong. That's what we always say. What a great show. I love the Go to Gadget. You know, have you yep. ever been to My Cool Gadgets? There's some pretty cool stuff up there. Really cool stuff that uh, you probably don't see in the stores, uh, you know, because we feature inventors' products. We fe feature our products. We feature our live shopping products. And they're all kind of unique because that in that world, it's not like Amazon where it's a kind of commodities. Those are really unique things. Like our buddy Steve Warple with his furniture glides, the Glide Guides. Go to his website, GlideGuys.com, yeah. I think it is. I'm Steve, if I'm wrong, just throw it up there, GlideGuys.com. Cool gadget. Cool gadgets everywhere. That's the today's daily wag. What a gadget. Instead of paying 25 bucks, $12.75. Nice. Free shipping on mycoolgadgets.com. Nice. I hear the music, Andrew. That yep. means they're gonna they're gonna usher me out of the building here. And that for that that will conclude another episode of My Cool Inventions. What a week we've had. We've had the Inventor Masterclass. We've had all awesome. kinds of great inventors through questions on there. What a fantastic week. God bless you all and keep inventing, keep being an entrepreneur, because that's what America's made of. Problem. It's an emergency. You're stuck in the car with no power. The windows are up, the doors are locked, and it's 95 degrees. What do you do? Solution, the tactical pen. Anybody can break the window without hurting themselves. Grip the tactical pen and tap the window and it'll break. No need to hit the glass with your fist or elbow. And also it has many other functions. Hi, I'm Akos. The Solution is here to tell you that the tactical pen is the Superman of pens. The tip is made of tungsten steel and it's designed to break any window with one tap. It also serves as a deterrent against your assailant. And here's the best part, it's a perfect pen. You can even write upside down with its Fisher Space cartridge. Break out, protect yourself, even write a note with the tactical pen. The tactical pen sells for $59.99, but today only on the Daily Gadget, $29.75. Call 1-888-877-0490. That's 1-888-877-0490. Or go to mycoolgadgets.com. You have beautiful potted flowers, and they're all on the patio ground where you really can't see them. And you have that fence that is plain and empty. 
Hi, I make us the solutionist with the perfect solution, the flower pot perfect hook. These hooks were created to bring your potted plants up off the ground to eye level where they're in plain view. And they'll make that fence beautiful with flowers all around. The flower pot perfect hook is made to hold most potted plants that have a lip. Make your yard, garden and patio beautiful with flowers. Normally the flower pot perfect hook sells for $29.99. But today only on The Daily Gadget, get four hooks and two support arms, all for $14.75. That's only $14.75. Call 1-888-877-0490. That's 1-888-877-0490. Or click on MyCoolGadgets.com. Order now. Your car is as hot as heck. And that stupid folding thing keeps falling down, not protecting the inside of your car at all. Hi, I'm Akos the Solutionist, and that can be a problem. The solution? The Keep Cool Sunshade. With this sunshade, you simply attach it to the windshield with suction cups on the passenger side, pull it across the windshield and hook it on the other cup on the driver's side. Done. Easy, quick, and no mess from that flicking cardboard folding thing. The answer to keeping your car cool the easy way is their self-retracting Keep Cool Sunshade. Normally one Keep Cool Sunshade sells for $19.95, but today on The Daily Gadget, half price, $9.75. Not only that, the next 50 customers will buy one, get one free, still only $9.75. To boot, free shipping. Call 1-888-877-0490. That's 1-888-877-0490. Or go to MyCoolGadgets.com. Order now.